guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do a project polish update and this is my first update for 2019 and I'm really really excited to tell you guys that I have an empty for this update. I'm kind of surprised and at the same time I'm really not because I have really focused on this polish and it was beginning to get thicker because I focused a lot on it in the fall time. So let me just show you what polishes I have been working on for the last month. The first polish that I finished is the e.l.f. nail polish in Smoky Brown. I bought this a long long time ago so that is why some of you may not know they made nail polishes. I bought this on sale. I was at the black line last update and on the intro and now I have finished it. I have worn it so much and I got the last thumb manicure on my uh, thumbs because the rest of them is the red polish that I have in this project as well. I can't get anything out. I need to screw it all the way down and tilt it at too much of a hassle for me to keep going. It's just too thick and goopy and I'm ready to move on from this really really nice nail polish. I'm really excited for it to be gone but yeah it's kind of sad at the same time you know. The last two that I have progress on is from Depend and the one I have on my nails right now is the dark red one and I don't think it has a name. 360. Okay, I haven't marked them, but hopefully you can see the progress. It's just above my nail. So there, I hope you can see it. It's really bright, so I can't see the screen probably. But I will mark it just after this update. I am so excited for this progress because I have only been using it for a week or something. And again, it is on most of my nails. I really, really like this color. My nails look so rough because it wasn't completely dry when I went to bed. So it's, it's messed up. And I tried layering it on top of a white base coat that I have from Essence. But I really like this base coat as it is. But it just made it even more streaky. I used two coats on my nails for it to be opaque and this dark red as it is on my nails. The next one is from a metallic line from Depend as well. It is this gray silver thing. I love it. It is so beautiful. I have the smallest amount of progress. So it's like above my nail here or something. The smallest amount of progress. I have used it as an accent, accent nail a few times. So because I only have two nail polishes left in the project, I am going to roll another one in and I'm actually going to roll in a glitter too. I like to have a dark nail polish in my project polish of all time because I really like dark nails overall but mostly on my toes. The brown one was the darker one so now I'm going to roll in my Essie licorice. Nail polish, just a standard, very black one. I won't say that I really like this nail polish because as I remember it chips a little bit bad. And I haven't seen or marked it since I made this kind of white mark right there. So I believe I have all of that left. I'm not really sure. But I am really looking forward to this black nail polish. And as I said, I was going to roll in a glitter and that is mostly because this is almost empty. And it is a Depend nail polish and it is uh, very old as well. So I haven't marked it because I'm unprepared and all of that stuff. So maybe you can see where I am there. I'm really, really low. And this is kind of gooby, but I don't mind. Uh, glitter being gooby because that I can work with. So yeah, I'm just really really excited for this update and I will update my wheel real soon because yeah, it, I have used one up and this is from last year and it still says 2018. I, I, I'm unprepared. <laughs> I don't have a, a blank nail wheel so that's kind of why I'm reusing filling it out, you know. 
I hope you don't mind. I'm a little unprepared, but I really wanted to film this update and it is Valentine's Day. So me and my boyfriend, we are going out to eat some food and I'm really, really excited. How do you like my small table? With the candle and then my empty spin is right there. Um, and my eye look is very pinky and it was a mess and it took forever because the shadows didn't want to work and I messed up my wink liner so I had to redo that. Before I ramble way too much I just want to say thank you so much for watching it means a lot to me. I hope you will stick around so subscribe down below for more videos like this and until my next video please take care. Bye!